Hi everyone, Mrs. A here. Today we're looking at the domain and range of functions. So I have for you a function, and if you look at that equation, think about what that represents on the graph. It's a parabola. And let's remind ourselves what domain and range means. So the domain of a function is all of the x values that the function can take on. That means all of the x's that it's going to go through when you think of the number line. And the range means all of the y values that the function is going to take on, which means thinking of the vertical number line, which values is the function going to go through. So I have a parabola, as I said, and I want to get a very rough sketch of this parabola to think about the domain and the range. So uh, I have a, a grid here, and I'm going to very roughly sketch this out, like extremely roughly, so you know, don't call me out on that. Um, this is a parabola which has a negative a value, so I know that it's open down. And it has a vertex here, because it's in vertex form, that is at negative 3, positive 4. So knowing that information, I can get a, a very rough sketch here. And I'm saying it's rough because I actually don't care about the zeros of this parabola. Um, I don't care too much about the shape of it. But what I do care about is its direction of opening and its vertex, because that is going to help me determine the domain and range here. So if I put a vertex at negative 3 and 4 here, and then I, I kind of show that it opens down like this. Let's, let's think about what's happening here. This parabola is going to go down here forever in that direction. And, and it's going to go down here forever in that direction. So thinking about the domain now, just the domain, we're thinking about the horizontal values. We're looking at that horizontal number line. If I go from left to right, my parabola is going to go infinitely to the left here because it's going to keep going down to the left. And it's going to go infinitely to the right. And it hits all of the values in between. So as we move from negative infinity to positive infinity horizontally, there is not a value here that x won't touch. x touches all of the numbers. And we're dealing with the real numbers here. So we're going to say that the domain for this function, and I'm going to do it in set notation, x is an element of the reals. x belongs to the real numbers here, and there are no restrictions. That is it. Uh, now, if you've been doing this in interval notation, I can write interval notation for those people who um, are familiar with it, and if you're not yet, that's okay. It's coming on later on. We would write it like this, from negative infinity to positive infinity. Now let's talk about the range. So the range is a little trickier for a parabola. So now looking at the parabola and going from, I'll go from bottom to the top because the number line, I like to start in the negative infinities and go to the positive infinities. Now, remember my parabola is going infinitely down. So it's going to hit all of the y values down here. So really all this negative, from negative infinity up, up, up is all going to go through for this function. There is a point though right here where the y values are no longer going to be touched. Do you see that? Because of that maximum uh, optimal value of this parabola. And that value is at y equals 4. And that's why we needed to have the vertex that we found here. So all of the y values for this particular function will be 4 or less. And that's our range. So let's write it in our set notation y is an element of the reals such that y is less than or equal to 4. And I'm using the equal sign because we do touch the 4, right, on that vertex. So that is important. If you want your interval notation, I'll do that. So we go from negative infinity to positive 4, and that's including the 4. So this is the domain and the range for this particular parabola. We always have to think about what it looks like on the graph in order to get that domain and range. Thanks for watching. This is A Loves Math.